He's the elder against Connor Bedard as the puck is dropped and we are underway for the final time in 2023. Pressured by Edwistle, fought through it. Three waves of pressure. Dallas able to muscle it out for Steele. He'll cross the line, feed it across, settling, shooting. Ben and Morazic sent it up and out of play with a save. Defense. What they don't want to see is a wide open sniper on the flank. Stars take the zone. Ben is able to toe drag for a second. Under nine to play here in the opening period. Stars pick it off. Craig Smith, nice dance past Phillips. A shot save. Morazic. Good individual work from Smith. Well, Phillips set him up. Trying an outlet pass, I think, to Berard in neutral ice. That just about blew up in his face. Here's Steele. Centering pass, and it got through Galandria. Hockey ball held it in for Steele. Turn, shoots, scored! Steele, the floater. Morazic was screened, and it found a hole. And it's Dallas who strikes first. The first turnover, and the Stars' fourth line continued on. Delandria showed a little bit of rust in his game when he got set up from behind the icing line. And Sam Steele, after doing that, just curls up top and sends one on net. And optically, Morazic couldn't find it. Way too many bodies in front of him. Might have even ticked off of Smith, although he reacted like it was all Sam Steele. I'm not so sure. They'll head to Nashville to open up 2024 and then out east for a couple of games. Stars take it away and in tight off the bar, Robertson. He got disheveled. His stick went far away while he regathers. It's Bedard, walks it to the high slot, shot off the bar, and then Wedgwood scrambling fell on it and managed to keep it out. A close call for the kid. As he was forechecking, the kid swerves into the middle, goes against the grain and had Wedgwood in full contortion mode. That pass laterally through the entire zone. Sharp angle shot, Felino handled by the Stars. Robertson, four across the line. They've got a trailer and Suter fed there. Suter, shot, score! Ryan Suter gets his first of the year before the calendar turns, and Dallas has doubled their lead have been under duress, but they've also been hurrying up ice to join the attack. This goes off of a defender on the Hawks. You can tell the bewilderment in goaltender Peter Morazic. Kurashev, the forward, coming back. It's an unsuccessful attempt to block it. It's a lot of room for Suter to rip it. And feed it on net. Morazic made the save. Kept alive in the trapezoid. Sagan. Muscles it up to Suter's. Got the most recent goal. Duchesne fights his way off a tug. A heavy check planted. Backdoor Sagan scores. Duchesne with some muscle. Marchman a set up. Sagan the finish. And Dallas gets one more here late in the first. Which is a real rarity. The kid Bedard was floundering on this shift. And as Murphy came over to greet Duchesne, Duchesne rattled his bicuspids. Got the puck to Marchman. He fed Sagan. It's yet another tap-in goal for the Stars against the Hawks. Man, that is planting a guy on the boards. All started with a turnover. By the Hawks. Stars wind up with three goals from nine different or three different players. Nine different players had points. One that has the Stars on the power play right now. And then another eyeball-to-eyeball -eyeball chance against Morazic. Dallas knows from earlier in the week that you can't get the overlapping penalties at a full two minutes. There's a shot, steal, and scores! A backhand gorgeous upstairs shot. There was Sam Steele with the Regina Pats. He would look like he was shot out of a cannon. Cut in there on the backhand and sizzled one around that white back bar up top. You can't tuck it better than this. A beauty in flight. 22-year-old rookie defenseman. Now a backdoor feed. Dickinson turned aside. Glove save by Wedgwood. 
Here's Duchesne. Leaves it left side for Sagan. Niels Lundqvist at the blue line. To the left circle, Sagan. Marchman settles. Shot. Score! Stars power play gets on the board, and Mason Marchman becomes the fifth different star to score in the game. Sagan on the boards. They understand that in the heart of the slot, there's going to be open space. And it's it's dreadful defending by the Hawks. They should be able to close on that because Marchman had to fight the puck for a second. Phillips' evening is, is continuing on, and he's able to chunk this one past Morazis. One of those sort of off-speed shots. Stars and Hawks each had 10 shots on goal in the second period. There wasn't much of a difference in what happened on the score sheet. I bet the conversation in the Stars room was, guys, we have plenty to win. Let's take care of business defensively, get through this penalty kill. Here's Gutman, Bedard, back for Kurashev, and he scores. That was gorgeous from a Hawk power play that wasn't doing much in the first two periods. Connor Bedard, the primary assist. And Kurashev gets the goal. Two-game set where the puck movement sets up a yawning cage. They take the line with tons of speed. They were really struggling with that. And it's pretty obvious that Scott Wedgwood bit hard that there was going to be a shot from Bedard. As he came across exit stage right, and nothing but net for Kurashev, although it was a rolling puck. And Gutman on the assist. Now Kurashev flipping it off to the left side boards. Kept alive, Bedard snapped a shot and a glove save by Wedgwood. And a snazzy save that time by Wedgwood. Out in front, Kurashev denied by Wedgwood. All the they work in the morning on drills and pucks around the net. Dropped off Harley, and save, rebound, score! Hits knocked it out of midair! Rope hits, bats it home. It's his fourth goal in the last two games against Chicago. Bouncing puck skipped over his blade. They follow it up there. Again, it's a downhill defenseman creeping in, and Thomas Harley changed the point of attack. Morazic can't handle it. Hints did this back in the first period on a drive-by that would have been over the crossbar. This one, a tap-in out of midair on a loose puck. On it. Dallas gets there, Haskin in around, and Wyatt Johnston in across the Chicago line on his forehand. Got it to Ben, backhand, and Soderblom makes the save, his first in the hockey game. Jason Roberts in the stretch. Here's Hintz already with a goal. Darting in. Hintz a backhand. Saved by Soderblom. He was looking for a hole on the backhand move. Duchesne steps to a loose puck. That Duchesne. Spin. Switch of directions once again. Trying to shed Phillips. That Duchesne gets it. Sagan off the bench. Shot. Score. Redirected between the circles. Mason Marchman. He's got the game the stars have seven in the game Sagan you can see him coming over the boards late in a change and he steps to the forward tees and spanks one toward the net Marchman just opens up there's token defending I'm not sure what Tenorti was doing there he didn't block the shot he didn't occupy the stick of Marchman and because of that, it's 7-1. Tuesday night game. Here's Duchesne in a backhand goes wide. Stars will stay put. Get ready for Montreal. And in front, it scores. And Marchman, that puck redirected. It pinballed its way. And Marchman is going to close off the hat trick. Starting to rain down. A difficult one to pinpoint the ballistics on it. You had to go to the lab to figure this one out as a wrist shot from the blue line off of Essel Lindell's stick goes off of Marchman. It was going to go about 15 feet wide of the net and it clanks in off the leg. Eight goals, the most they've ever scored in a New Year's Eve game.
A wire-to-wire -wire trouncing of the Blackhawks, and Happy New Year indeed.